In today's video, you get a completely free like, subscribe, and get notified graphic, kind of like the one that just played right there. Let's get into it. Hey guys, what's up? It's Bravity, and welcome back to another video here on my channel. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So today, we're taking a look at this awesome like, subscribe, and get notified graphic. I've done like graphics before, I've done subscribe graphics before, but I haven't really done one with the get notified that I really like that's super clean. So today, we're going to be tackling that, and I'm going to give it to you guys completely free. I'm going to give you guys the After Effects project, but I'm also going to show you how you can get this for free to use in your YouTube videos if you do not own After Effects. So first off, we're going to jump into After Effects. We're going to take a look at it. I'm going to provide the After Effects file for you just in case you just want to edit it, say something else. If you want to make it for Twitch, you can take these animations and make it a Twitch animation. Whatever you want, you've got the project file, but we're going to take a look at that. I'm going to show you kind of how it works, and then we're going to take a look at how to get it completely free if you do not have After Effects. So let's jump into After Effects and take a look. So here we are inside of After Effects. When you open it up, it is just going to be a very basic project. You've got two compositions, you've got your final render, and you've got your edits. So the final render is where you're just gonna play it and render it out when you've got it completely done. All the graphics are here. It animates out, ready to go. But when you wanna change stuff, you just wanna jump into the Edits tab here. And inside the Edits tab, you've got the chaos of the animations that are going on. You've got the bell icon here you can swap out. You've got the YouTube icon here you can swap out. You've got the light graphic icon you can swap out and then you've got all the text that you can swap out there's a bunch of different text layers as you can see the reason there's a bunch of different text layers is you see when it first animates in it says just like and then when it clicks it changes to liked in past tense same here subscribe it changes to subscribed but get notified stays get notified because it's already in past tense so those text layers change and that's why there's so much text going on here so you'll have to edit a couple things then you've got the little abstract two layers you see you got a couple layers here that stay abstract two those are the little splash effects the little click graphics that go on when you click they go whoosh and they fly out like that. You can get stuff like that for your own animations from places like Storyblocks. I'm not sponsored by Storyblocks, but Storyblocks is an incredible place to get things like this, to add to your motion graphics, to add little splash effects. It's a really cool website where you can download a lot of stuff. I'm not sponsored by them. Would love to be sponsored by Storyblocks, but I am not. They're just a really cool place to get things like that. So take a look at Storyblocks for adding awesome things like this to your animations. But then you go down a little bit further and you've got all the shape layers. You've got a couple different shape layers for each of the buttons because they have to switch from gray to blue and then from gray to red and then from gray to yellow. But that is all that's going on in the animation. Everything is parented to the shape layers. So the only animation that's going on is inside the shape layers. And then the like text and then the graphics are all parented to the shape layers. So they're really easy to change. They'll follow it. So you can go up here and you can change where it says like to whatever you want. You can change it to follow. You might need to extend the boxes a little bit, but you're going to see that the text is already going to follow the box for you. So you can jump in here, use my animation and change it to be whatever you want and then when you're done you jump back into final render and this is where you're going to render it out i've covered how to render out in after effects so many times with an alpha channel that i'm not going to cover that but if you guys want to see how to render out and how to make an animation like this from scratch i'll put a link up in the corner right here to a video where i did a very similar effect to this where a button comes up and it gets clicked and changed colors and the text changes i did a video similar to that right here so if you want to see how to edit something like that and animate something like that from scratch you can click on that but that's pretty much it for the After Effects side of this. It's really easy to edit this if you just want to make it say whatever you want. But if you guys don't have After Effects or you just don't want to mess around with it, you don't want to change anything, you want it just how it is, in the link in the description where you can download the After Effects file, I'm also including a pre-exported file in a quick time format. It's already got the alpha background, already got the transparent background, so you can just drop it into whatever editor you're using. It's already got a transparent background, you're ready to put it on top of your footage, and you're good to go. No After Effects necessary. But that's pretty much it for this video, guys. It was a little bit of a shorter one. I did not have as much time to create one this week, but I hope you guys enjoyed this graphic. I have been wanting to create a like, subscribe, and get notified graphic like this for a long time. It's just very clean. I love the bright colors popping up at the bottom. I might even start using something similar to this for my YouTube channel as well. So if you guys want to have this for your very own YouTube channel, a nice clean graphic, make sure you download it in the link in the description, and I will see you guys in the next video.